All right, R and W here. This is part four. Going home tonight. Vito Brata again. Okay, we ended uh, part three. Let's see here. <laughs> Okay, that chord there is where we ended it at. It's actually supposed to be clean. That's not clean. Okay, after we dive on this chord, slow, a little bit of, let me tighten that up here. Okay, here we go. And we've got a little lick here. Uh, nine on your D, and then seven, six on your G, and then E open. It's actually slides both times, I think. Let's see. Okay, there we go. Let me turn this nastiness down a little bit. This EMG is uh, about got to turn the volume all the way down to get any clean out of it. <laughs> okay, here we go. Um... Okay, now, that, I said that's uh, 9 on your D, 7, 6 on your uh, G, and then E open, and then 2, 2, uh, B and E open, and then 1, B and E open. Let it ring out just a second. Go one open on your B, one on your G, open on your B, and then we slide kind of fast one to two on your G, B open. So we go one open B, okay, and then four open B, four on your G. So we got. Uh, I keep forgetting to slide. Okay. Okay. And then we go do our little A chord there. And then we do this lick again. Where we did uh, seven on your D, six, seven hammer on on your G, and then five on your B. And that's fun part. I explained that in, in uh, part three. Hopefully you've already got to practice it some so you know where it's at, frets, frets wise. Okay. And then we, we go, uh, we're basically repeating all the what we've already done. So there's a couple little different things in there. So... Okay, this time, instead of doing, we go hit the D chord on this on these chords here that we've done a hundred times in this song already, and then we get your bar on this, okay, on the four on this chord. You hit six on your D. Just just think of this chord that we've we've already done in the intro and in the pre-chorus and all that stuff and we hit the D and then high E up to your G okay and then you go up to this one your four two three actually four now I got your E in there this time so we never used the, the high E in those chords until now Okay, so we come back in after that, and we got this again. Okay, and, and this time you don't uh, go like 
you, you, okay, last time we went like this. And then, or, excuse me, this. If you want, you can slide up to five. It's actually how he does it. Excuse me, slide down to five. Okay, and, and we don't throw in the five next uh, on this time like we did before. So we don't go. We did that last time. He Every time now he goes. Why, I don't know, but why ask why? And you go into, we got the pre-chorus. Okay, so. Remember this, we did it in, in part three. We did this too. This time, uh, seven on your G, ten ten on your B and E. Slide up and then just hit it. Hit it again. And then you got the chorus. We already done that in part three. Throw that in in your chorus where you go, uh, we did that little late just a minute ago. Okay. Now. We got the lead. Okay. So, like I said on part three, I was going to do the lead, but there's uh, a lot of, well, there's not a lot, there's a couple decent uh, tutorials on the guitar solo for this song. But uh, you guys think I should do it, just leave it in the comments or something. And uh, I'm not being lazy, I'm just, uh, the ones that I'm doing are the ones that are harder to find. That's what I try to do is uh, do the veto stuff that you can't just type it in and then 100 videos on YouTube is going to pop up. So that's what I'm trying to do here. I don't want to do stuff that, you know, a thousand people's already done and all that. It's kind of pointless, but... Uh, I'm just trying to bring stuff to you that, that you can't find. So, and if you're like me, which a lot of you are, you love the white line stuff. Vito's the master. I have to wet my whistle. And, um, all right. Thanks, guys. And, uh, be seeing you on the next one. R&W signing out. Later.